Hi guys, Snake Dodder here. Welcome back to Chaos Under Ponia. Right, well, last time we'd uh, left uh, left Rufus here with Goal. Goal had just strangled the uh, the seer and uh, choked him. And so yeah, let's head off back to the cutter now and uh, let's move on. So let's get on the uh, let's get on the radar. I think we've got to head off to the north uh, the North Pole now. I think if we can, we've got to find that. There we go. There's the North Pole. A look at the uh, for the uh, for the lottery answers within the stars. That's what the seer told us. The guru said the lottery numbers were in the stars. I wonder what he meant by that. Four, eight, fifteen, sixteen. Ah, oh, <laughs> maybe he meant. Maybe that. he did. Let's look again. Guru was right after all. Four, eight, fifteen, sixteen, twenty-three, and forty-two. I think that now was. Now I'm almost sorry about what I scribbled on his diploma in the <laughs> Rufus. Okay, let's go back on the cutter then. Now, now we know the lottery numbers. I don't think that actually made any difference to the story. But uh, right, should we go to the uh, floating back market? All the way back. Oh look, there's Seagull. Today is not your lucky day, Seagull. He's going on the background there in the doorway. Firing shots. Pile of garbage, but they found no trace of the girl. She was here. Why would I lie to you? It looks very dark I as well. I don't know. You appear to suffer from an inflated ego, just like your son. Rufus is not my son. You can do whatever you want with him, but we had a deal. You wanted a tip, and I gave you one. Can I help it if your people Can are I shoot totally this gun again in the background? You are wasting my time. Oh no! See, I can't stand see gold's been shot. Time is being wasted. Hey you! Tone it down a bit. You're scaring the fish. I'm sorry. It won't happen again. <laughs> I want every nook and cranny of this junk pile turned inside out once more and close off all access to the harbor. Even if a rat tries to get out of here, I want to know. Goes Captain Swingy Shoulders. Right, so it's sealed. Here's Rufus and Gold now, that's lucky. A couple of seconds earlier. That was Argus with his They've been caught. Hands. So the Organon is already after us. Shh! He's right. We need to be careful. Okay. Um, should we take some more fish bait? Not good that will do us, but we. Hey, what do you think you're doing? I, I'm, uh, I'm uh, b bowing before Neptune. Or uh, isn't that him? What? Where? Well done. Are you mocking Misdirection me? from mocking, Rufus. Mocking, good man. Mocking, something like that. Yeah, yeah. mocking Robin. It's a uh, mocking Robin. Yeah, it's a song. Uh, let's go in the gadget shop, shall we? Can't go anywhere else, I don't suppose. I'll try pushing it open. The door was firmly locked. Ooh, the narrator's giving us some some speech. Where's this bowl come from? Why is the food bowl out here when the cat is locked up inside? Either someone is acting out their sadism, or the cat knows a secret way to get outside. Hmm. Well, the cat's there. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Here, kitty. Show Uncle Rufus <laughs> the secret way into the Come gadget on, show shop. Uncle Rufus. Uh, no. Nope. listening. Damn. Which is obviously due to the fact that cats, in general, have very poor hearing. Maybe. Well, we can't really go anywhere, can we? So let's just get back on the cutter. Let's see where else we can uh, we can head off to. There was one other, wasn't there? There was... Port of Fisco. Let's go back there again. So, what have we got in our... We've got this torch, haven't we? Should we use that on that barrel? So we can get a torch. We might be able to head up to that, um, up that alleyway there. <laughs> Rufus, have fire! <laughs> <gasps> Caveman Rufus. Well, we have a burning torch now. Okay, so let's uh, oops, let's go back and uh, let's go up this street to the street canyon where the uh, the organ on are still s surrounding us. Now, can we burn these tires? I wonder if that'll work. 
What's better than a mountain of tires? Right, burning a tires. Of burning tires. <laughs> <laughs> right now, where do we go? Uh, where do we go? Uh, should we go? We go back down, do we? Something's happening. Sounds like something's happening anyway. Hmm. Right. Let's uh, let's head off. Should we go back to the uh, back to the the resistance headquarters? Let's go back in again. Phew. We haven't got to do the entry knock again. That was a painful uh, thing. Right. Let's have a chat to. Uh, Hey, you, should Uncle Rufus teach you a couple of tricks? Hmm? Oh, they're so happy. Sweet. <laughs> Actually, there was a tire, wasn't there, that fell at my feet? Should we grab that first? I'm reckon I reckon we can pick that up. Yeah, it was too much of a coincidence. I just saw that uh, sort of Reminded me. I think we should have done that. Right, let's go back in here. Okay, so there, uh, we've played with them, haven't we? Uh, so, I wonder if that tyre comes in useful. If we, cause it's a hot sign there. If we place it in there, will this do anything? What's that supposed to be? Uh, um, nothing. I want to teach the baby dolphins a couple of tricks. You want to do what? Oh, did I say teach? <laughs> show. Jump them. Of course I meant show. I want to show them a couple of tricks to cheer them up. I don't want them to end up depressed like their parents. If anything happens to them, I will kill no. you. I'm serious. I will kill you. I have you. a horrible feeling. The nice lady didn't say that. Once she sees how great you are at jumping through the burning hoops, she'll <laughs> be blown away. So let's go. Alley Yoop! Hmm. They still need a little incentive. Um. Alley Yoop! Hmm. They still need a little okay. incentive. Okay. Well, how do we. Why are the torpedo dolphins so small? Those aren't torpedo dolphins, you moron. They're their offspring. Baby dolphins? Oh, actually, there. they need some incentive. What was that? What, what was what? Your look. You had that look again. I, I did not. Get away from the pool. No. Yes, all right, all right. I have a feeling we can use the f fish bait on the tire. Yes, that's the way I can teach the dolphins the hoop trick. Oh boy, Tony will be so impressed. I can hardly wait to show her who's the real dolphin trainer around here. Okay. Here, fishy no. fishy! I have a horrible feeling they're going to jump through there and get killed, aren't they? Oh no! <laughs> no! On the other hand, Tony seems to be really busy <laughs> No! We just killed the dolphins and turned them into tuna somehow. Can we grab that as well? A pool full of water. Let's um, let's go. I think <laughs> quickly. <laughs> let's just go before Tony realizes what's happened. Um, all right. Should we get back to the cutter? And uh, maybe we should get back to the uh, floating bat market, which was there. Head on back again. Right now we've got some tuna. I wonder if we can get the uh, the cat out. I reckon that's the cat flap we've got to try and get the cat out of. So let's use the tuna on the bowl. His hearing might not be very good. Here, kitty, but his sense kitty, of smell kitty, kitty, is awesome. Here, kitty. Look what yummies I have here. Oh, look. <laughs> He's interested. She's interested. Soon, I don't know which one it is. Why the food bowl is outside 
although the cat is locked up inside. It can't be both inside and not inside at the same time. It's true. Unless of I course, like your logic. Unless, of course, this is a Schrodinger cat. Quantum mechanical zombies. Not really dead. Not really alive. Take cover, goal. What? I just unleashed the overwhelming force <laughs> of wave particle dualism. I don't think you did. It's just a cat flap. Okay. No. What's wrong? I have no idea what you're talking about. I don't, I don't I think any of us, any of us do. Of quantum mechanics. There's a cat flap. Brilliant. Let's go through the cat flap then. I may be as agile as a cat, but unfortunately, I'm also as muscular as a lion. <laughs> huh. With my broad shoulders, I'd never fit through well, that goals, narrow flap. Goals, goals, nice and svelte. So let's see if she'll come and uh, come and help us. Hey, Goal. Everything okay? Well, one third of my mind has fled. The Organon is occupying the floating black market. And if we don't do something soon, Ulysses will blow up the planet right under our feet. I told you this would Other be fun. Other than that, she's fine. I thought you were just bragging. Okay. Come on, then. Through the cat flap, please. Can you fit through the cat flap? <laughs> You're too fat, aren't you? No. Hey, that that's all muscle. Wanna touch it? <laughs> Ugh, no thanks. I don't want to catch Woblitis. Woblitis. wobbling. The light is just We've bad. all got a touch Step of Woblitis. Step aside, Bubba. I'll show you how it's done. Thank you. Don't rush. Perfect. I'm sure I could have got through there. There you go. Brilliant. And impressed? Amazingly. Uh, I don't know. Can you do it again? I was uh, <laughs> a little distracted. <laughs> Forget it. All right, let's go. On we go. I hope you know what you're doing. Let's get in the door. Hopefully it's unlocked now. She hasn't just locked it again afterwards. Nope, she hasn't. Good. Okay. Now, do we need to use... The banana straightener. <laughs> Fantastic. But that is really the last time I help Mother Nature iron out the wrinkles in her design <laughs> problems. Good man. Okay, we have a straight banana. I don't think we need any others. Uh, lotto mat. Oh, so we can get the lottery numbers. Hey, yes. Playing the lottery has nothing to do with luck. Only with threatening a seer with physical violence. So maybe we can. Well, we'll have the numbers now, won't we? <laughs> hey! Bingo! So, what does. Uh, where's the prize thingy? How do we get our prize? Do we just use it on the, on, the, on the machine? The old robot machine that's struggling? Hey, you! I want to pick up my winnings! I. Oh, what was that? Oh, oh, thanks. It worked. What have we just got then? Torpedo equipment. Hey, awesome. Okay, well, we can use that back at the resistance, can't we? Uh, brilliant. Well, I guess that's probably a good place to end this video. We've uh, done quite well. Only a relatively short one today, but um, yeah. Thanks, thanks for watching, guys. Please remember to like, share, and favourite the video. And come back soon for the next part. And we'll see what further adventures Rufus can get on. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.